Let's set up Poly Studio R30 in a BYOD room from right out of the box. And the first step is gonna to be to unpack all the contents. Now we'll go ahead and get all of the cables connected, starting with the power cable. And then the USB cable. Once both of the cables are connected, we'll go ahead and connect the included monitor clamp. Once everything is connected, you can just set the device on top of your monitor and adjust the angle using the clamp. In a room like this one, it's best to have the device slightly pointed down for the best angle. Plug in the power cable to an outlet and the device will automatically power on. You'll want to route your USB cable behind the monitor and onto the table so the user can easily plug into their computer to start the meeting. Remember, you'll also need an HDMI cable running from the display to connect to the user's laptop. For the easiest user experience, add a dock to your setup and connect the USB cable from the Studio R30 and the HDMI cable from your display into the dock. This simplifies the connection for the user and also provides the added benefit of powering their laptop so they don't have to worry about setting up their power supply. When the user is ready to start their meeting, they just need to connect to a single USB-C cable from their dock. To finish your setup, you can opt to download PolyLens and customize your product settings like framing modes and noise reduction technologies so that these features are automatically enabled when your users start their meetings. Type in the default password to start customizing. And with that, your meetings are set up for success. Happy conferencing!